All right, we are underway with the Creality High versus Bamboo A1 printing out Stargates, because you know, you need Stargates in pairs. Somewhere in that process, the infill changed. This has, I'm not even sure what infill pattern this is. This looks like it defaulted to grid, which I would never choose intentionally. So that could be why there is the time discrepancy, why this one is taking three hours longer than this one. So we'll keep that in mind when we're comparing, but hopefully it won't affect the surface details, which is gonna be the most important thing we're looking at. All right, let's take a look at our Stargates. Now, here we have the Bamboo A1, and this came out really clean, like a little, that's not even stringing, that is German Shepherd hair. Um, yeah, this, this came out excellent. The, the symbols are nice and easy to read. I used that water texture plate, which is kind of cool. There's a, nope, that's nothing permanent. That was just strings that were on the surface. No color contamination. Okay, so the A1, you know, as predicted, came out pretty nice. And now this is the Creality High. And I actually do like this shade of blue that they gave me. So, again, that's just some, some dirt on there. That's not actual stringing. Symbols are very clean. The bottom layer is really nice. There's no texture plate because it was just the resin sheet, but uh, solid, perfect first layer. Detail on the chevrons and the symbols is is really good. I would say this is on par. Uh, this is very close, uh, it, like honestly, almost identical in quality in my opinion. Um, print speed was about the same. It did estimate that the Creality would finish faster, but in reality, it took about the same amount of time. So uh, this is a great alternative, like uh, a, a really good alternative printer if you're in the market for a multicolor bed slinger.